So I'm fortunate to have really good relationships with my patients, and a lot of these relationships actually lead to us having some fairly deep conversations. And one of the favorite conversations I had recently uh, with one of my patients was basically on uh, their their fear and how a lot of people's fear actually, uh, you know, as they get older, is losing um, their independence, right? And becoming dependent on others taking care of them, uh, you know, not being able to, to do certain things for themselves anymore. And this, this conversation was great because, it, I mean, it's a, it's a legit fear that, that people have. Uh, not everybody thinks about as they're younger uh, when they can make the most impact on it. But when, you know, when they're older, as they're getting older and as they start to see, you know, the potential of that happening even more. Um, and one of the... Yeah, you know, the conversation led to the difference between having a great lifespan versus having a great health span. So many of us are familiar with lifespan, where it's how long do you live? So you know, people shoot for living uh, in you know that they want to live past ninety, they want to live past a hundred, uh, different things like that. Whereas health span is actually how healthy are you for as long as you live? Uh, so you can be a hundred years old, but you could be you know. Uh, maybe wheelchair bound or not unable to take care of yourself, different things like that. Um, and so knowing the difference between that and, and really understanding, you know, that there's a difference between living a long life that is low quality and then living a, a long life that's high quality. Uh, and what most people don't think about shooting for is living a long, high quality life. Uh, and that's where you're able to go and again, just be independent. You can, uh, you know, go and, you know, if you were to fall on the floor, different things like that, pick, you're able to pick yourself up. You don't need anybody's help. And all that comes with making sure you take care of your body and not in, in a number of different ways. Uh, you know, at, at Ethos, our main things are um, movement, nutrition, sleep, um, and uh, you know, making sure you have enough energy and vitality and everything like that. Uh, and so, you know, those are some things that you can work on to help improve your uh, health span as opposed to just improving your lifespan. Uh, so if you're not doing those, pay attention to it. Do some strength training. Uh, you know, strength training is a great way to, to train yourself to not break a hip down the road. Um, and, you know, do those things and you'll be able to increase your health span and, uh, and you know, have a high quality life. Uh, so that's my thought of the day and I hope you all make it a great day.